Hey, how are you guys doing today? My name is Perky. I'm bringing you another Call of Duty commentary. This one is actually a flawless Moab. I believe I go 44 and 0. Uh, I, actually, I actually have 15 assists. I don't know what is going on with that. I, I must have had just really poor aim this day because I felt like none of my bullets were kill shots. I just kept putting a couple into them and letting my partners pick stuff off. But uh, you'll see I'm running with a full DB team. A couple of them aren't tagged up, and most of them are just trolling. Uh, just doing a quick pub stomp map match, nothing too spectacular or anything. But uh, getting some domination on here. Uh, you'll notice that my primary weapon is a M4 uh, with a silencer and a red dot sight. I've actually grown to like that gun a whole lot. Uh, my secondary is a P90 with rapid fire and silencer. That's kind of what I wanted to talk about today. I really wanted to talk about how I feel that uh, Overkill is an undervalued perk. I think it's uh, it's so useful, and I, I just don't see a whole lot of people using it. A lot of people actually make fun of me for using it. I think it's I think it's awesome. Like I I hear. Uh, I try to avoid using the Akimbo's and everything, and then everybody tells me that the M M9 or MP9, what the fuck that is, uh, is kind of like a mini P90 or MP7, and yeah, it's a good secondary, that's for sure, but I just really like the power behind the second primary, it's just, it feels like I'm, I can dominate long range with an assault rifle like this, and then when I'm in close range I can whip out that submachine gun and just really go to town. And it's, it's also nice when you have a sniper class, you know, have a submachine gun or something for uh, those close range encounters. And to be honest, I can't really find a whole lot of use out of the other perks in the second slot there. Like, we got Hardline, which is really helpful, but, you know, it's just, it's nothing that is necessary to have. Because, I mean, yeah, getting a kill for every two assists is pretty sweet. Uh, it's nice getting your specialist bonus a little earlier. But nothing that uh, that you really need. And then assassin, that's really helpful, especially against clans. Almost necessary against clans, in fact. But when you're against randoms like this, it's you know it's just a perk that uh, that you can live without. It's nothing too special. Um, blast shield. The tubes are already underpowered, so that's kind of a useless perk. Um, then we got what is it? Quick draw. You know, that's kind of nice, especially on the assault rifle classes, but, I mean, let's be honest, it, like, it cuts down the aim down the sight time by, like, I don't know, half a second or something. It's it's nothing too life-changing, in my opinion, and you can live till a specialist bonus to actually get that. And that kind of leaves me with overkill. When I'm not playing against an organized clan, it's nice to have a gun that can really... You know, if I'm out of ammo with my primary weapon, or I'm just at a disadvantage using my primary weapon, you know, in close quarters with an assault rifle or something like that, I can whip out my secondary, which is just as useful, but uh, designed for different situations. You know, some machine gun versus the assault rifle, like I got going on right here. It's nice to have, and I think it's so undervalued right now. I just, I don't know why, because. I've never seen anybody use it, and it's on so many of my classes. I've got uh, I got one with the M4 and P90. You're seeing that now. Uh, I'm digging the CM901, and right now I think I have a P90 on there as well. I used to have an MP7 on it. I'm trying to stay away from all those guns that are so often complained about. But uh, CM901 is a great gun, by the way. If you don't use that, throw a silencer and kick on there. Uh, once you get used to the to the odd recoil, it's actually really, really powerful. But yeah, it's just really nice to have that versatility, you know, you can be powerful at a range with an assault rifle or a sniper rifle, and then you can be really powerful in close quarters because you can whip out a shotgun or a submachine gun or something like that. And uh, as good as the MP9 is, it's not um, not up to par with some of these, these primary weapons, obviously. It's a good substitute if you don't want to use overkill, and uh, if, you, if you have assassin on or something like that, or hardline on. But P90 will still win in that battle any day. There's no doubt about that. So it's a lot of fun for me to use. I don't know. I, I would really recommend you guys give it a shot. Uh, overkill Pro lets you have attachments on your second second primary, 
And uh, so yeah, I've got the, the rapid fire silencer combo on my P90. And uh, it's it's nice and you really can't be complained about if you're you know, not using MP7, ACR, akimbos, you know, all that stuff, so. But uh, yeah, I got, a, I got a solid spawn trap going on there for a little while and I ended up getting that Moab. Pretty sexy stuff. I did want to quick mention though that um, you saw me kind of skip over guys a whole bunch of times and sprint away. Uh, and there was actually a reason for doing that. It's not that I didn't see the guys. It was just that I was in a position where had I popped out there was a good chance they would have taken my face off because they were already they already knew where I was, they were looking at me. So I ended up running around to a different area and picking off some of the teammates who were who were trying to flank me. And I might have just been paranoid, I don't know. These guys seemed like they just weren't even shooting at me for a lot of this game. A lot of them just kind of stared at me as I was shooting their friends, but I was uh I didn't feel like taking any chances, felt like uh, getting a Moab, so I'd, uh, I always ran away when I felt that I was going to be in a bad position or if they were in a, a, in more cover than I would be if I were going to turn the corner. And then, you know, just trying to play smart because I knew I was, uh, I was trying for a flawless game here and hoping to get it. So, didn't want to take any stupid chances. But I am going to wrap things up here, guys. I do appreciate you watching the commentary. Please do toss a like on here and subscribe if you haven't already. My name is Perky. We ended up dominating them pretty hardcore in this game. And uh, I will talk to you guys next time. See you.